Happy Sunday, everyone. Can you believe that we're going to start week three already? I, I can hardly believe it. So week three is very much like last week. You'll have your uh, case study discussion due on Wednesday. Uh, and let's see, I'm getting to that. And the case study discussion is in your Quinn book on dysmenorrhea. So you'll be responsible for answering these six questions and then um, commenting back and forth on your um, submissions from your peers in class and answering questions that people have um, asked you as well. Be mindful, I read every entry, so uh, if I have asked you a question, I expect you to answer it. If you don't get a grade, it's because you haven't answered it, and then once you answer the question, I will submit your grade. It, it kind of is a check and balance system for me uh, when I am going through everyone's um, entries. Then you have a soap note due. Now, I haven't yet had an opportunity to go get through everybody's soap notes, so I'm going to, um, that's my goal for early this week to ensure that I get through all of those because I have a presentation that I developed on soap notes, but I do change it up a little bit with every class session because uh, some students may have greater needs on um, the S part or the A part, so I, I want to get a good grasp on the class's uh, understanding of soap notes now, um, and then I will adjust the presentation to um, help meet your needs better. So, uh, and then on, so Friday your soap note will be due, and Sunday evening you have to have all of your responses done. So. Anything that you want to comment on your postings on that discussion group three have to be done by midnight Sunday or else they don't count. And I do have a little tool that will tell me, bing, this was, this was submitted after the due date. So um, that's really it for the, the week three. So if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to send me an email or a text message. I do have a couple questions that I'm going to be answering about the paper scores, so I will be getting back to some of you students in regard to that, so I didn't forget about you. And um, have a wonderful week.